Welcome to the Windows and Computer Channel and um, another way of signing in that we'll talk about with uh, Windows Hello because Windows Hello is a, a bunch of different ways of actually removing the requirement for passwords and logging in with some uh, biometrics or uh, in this case we're going to show you how to set up a PIN which often makes it easier than actually using the major passwords you use all the time. The advantage of the PIN is that it could be a simpler way of entering into your PC and because it is only on your PC that this happens or on related PCs with Windows 10 that you have on your own network, it doesn't compromise any passwords or anything. All is done in the background automatically. Also, what is nice is if you have super long passwords, sometimes what is really complicated is that when you actually enable apps or enable any software that requires authentication, what happens is that you have to enter that super long password. In most cases in Windows 10, what's going to happen is it's actually going to ask you just for the PIN rather than anything else, which is going to be much simpler. So to set up a PIN to log into your PC, rather than that big password you might have, Go into Settings, Accounts. On the left side, you have Sign-in Options. And here, you simply click Windows Hello PIN. Here, it's going to uh, ask you to actually set a PIN. So in my case, uh, I already have one, so I can actually click the Change button, or I can click Remove the PIN if I want. In the case where you don't have a PIN yet you're going to have a setup and it's going to ask you to enter a pin twice from that moment every time you'll log into your pc instead of that password you'll just have to enter a pin so this is a simpler form of password and um, it of course keeps your computer safe still it is really just for your local accounts so of course if you go online to your microsoft account for example you will be required to still enter a password. But sometimes when it's an app, for example, that's related to your Windows 10 machine, uh, when it wants to log into your accounts, Microsoft account, for example, it might actually, and most of the time, will actually ask you for the PIN rather than the password, which is nice. The danger of that is if you don't use a password manager is that over time you might forget your password, so make sure that you do not. But this makes it much simpler to uh, log into your PC than using a big, long, complicated password. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up, and thank you for watching.